Hey creative, what's up? It's your girl Jamila and welcome back to my laboratory. So I got this comment on an old TikTok I made. So of course I had to look into it and make an updated video for you guys. Everything I mentioned in this video will be listed in the description box. So make sure you check it out. And of course, if you like this video, you learned something new, make sure you give it a thumbs up, share it with your friends and make sure that bell notification is on so you don't miss any of my upcoming craft tutorials. All right, creative. So this video is all things mockups in Canva. So the first way you can do mockups in Canva is by using their smart mockups, right? And you can access that from your homepage and you can go right over here to your left and hit apps. Now, a lot of the things I'm showing you are Canva Pro features. So if you see anything with the crown next to it, it's a Canva Pro feature and you will need Canva Pro to access it. I will have a free 30 day trial for you listed in the description box of this video so that you can get your Canva Pro. Okay, listen, you may have a thousand subscriptions going on, but I promise you Canva Pro is worth it. Okay, so definitely go ahead and click that link and get your trial. So now that we're in the apps, we can go right over here to the left where it says mockups, or you can hit, um, you can type in smart mockups in the search bar and it'll bring it up as well Oop. if if you spell it correctly <laughs> all right so then you hit enter and right here there we go mock-ups so now we're just going to go ahead and use a new design or use an existing design whatever it is you want to do it's going to ask you what size you want let's just do instagram for now so if you're doing it in canva over here to your left they're going to show you that the mock-ups that they have available right a lot of great things in here super cute you know easy to use it's basically all just drag and drop you'll drag a photo over and let me just show you real quick okay so we'll take this oh it gives you directions too look at that so we'll take this and we'll go to let me go to one of my uploads and look this is a picture and i'll just drag it over here and there i have it if you were doing a sweatshirt with just you know like a small um chest design like that here's your mock-up right there okay so another way that you can do this is going to smartmockups.com it's basically the same app that we just used on canva but they have more options on their website okay um and like i said they're linked with canva so you see these little crowns right here you can download those for free if you have the canva pro if you don't 30-day trial will be free listed for you in the description box of this video and it's the same thing let's take this mock-up for example and this is actually the mock-up that was being talked about in the TikTok video okay so it's still available um canva just kind of changed the way that you can access it all right so we'll just take this mock-up we'll go ahead and upload let's upload an image let's see what we can find here oh look here's actually an image that i've been practicing for graduation season and i have a bunch of graduation tutorials coming up for you guys so if you're interested in uh, learning how to do stoles and t-shirts like this designs like this for graduation season uh i will have a link in the description box where you can sign up for my email list where i'll send you all whenever i make a tutorial i'll send you an email like hey this week's tutorial is up yada 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 okay so if you're interested in doing all that in canva go ahead and sign up for that with the um, link in the description box so this is our photo right they uploaded it they pulled the colors for it they matched the um matched it up for us it looks very very nice this would actually make a super cute shirt and we might just go ahead and make that on my youtube channel okay <laughs> so make sure you're subscribed and locked in now just in case you didn't see what i did i went right over here to this little pencil because you can edit it a little bit if you want like if you see right here congrats is kind of cut off right so we can bring this down and now it's more visible we can zoom in and all those other things i'm not going to go into great detail on that because i do already have a tutorial for that and i'll just go ahead and link it on here so you can um know how to exactly design your mock-ups using smartmockups.com okay so then you would just hit crop and continue and 
bam then you would just go ahead and download that super easy okay so that's like an all over shirt mock-up that you can do in canva and of course they have a bunch of different things okay so just go ahead around and click up click around on the app explore and see what they have so that is smartmockup.com and we just did the one in canva right now since canva is constantly updating and changing Another suggestion I have for you to do mock-ups is creativefabrica.com, okay? Now, Creative Fabrica, again, is another monthly subscription, but I have a link in the description box where you can get 10 free downloads, and after that, it'll be $9.99 a month, or if you're watching this video before February 14, 2024, they're currently running a promotion where you can get the all access pass for just $47 for the full year. Okay. And with Creative Fabrica, when you download something, look, you get the commercial license, unlimited downloads. So you can come on here, pay your $47, download everything they have on this website. And you'll be fine okay and a lot of people that sell on etsy also have an account with creative fabrica so instead of going on etsy and buying something individually you can sometimes all sometimes not always find the exact same thing on creative fabrica okay so creative fabrica has a bunch of mock-ups that you can use with canva like this tumblr okay so they have this tumbler one let's see they have this full shirt one on a model they have another tumbler one but these are like flat lays um with a bunch of different backgrounds okay um what else do they have this is another tumbler one but this is like an animated one where it the tumbler actually rotates and all of these can be used within canva okay and i'll have all of these mock-ups listed for you in the description box of this video and then they have this super big bundle that just has a bunch of different mock-ups as well so all of these are great options if you can't listen i don't know how to use photoshop okay i discovered canva and just was never interested in learning how to do photoshop because you can do so many great things so they, they have this super big bundle with a bunch of different mock-ups in it as well so creative fabrica oh look look over here oh they have gift rack mock-ups the enamel mugs candle jars coffee mugs listen even if you don't want to pay the whole $47, you can go ahead and get your 10 free downloads, right? After your 10 free downloads, it'll be $9.99 a month. And you can't, look, this this right here is four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. All these is, these mock-ups I'm showing you is probably going to be your 10 downloads. But do you think that's not worth it? It's definitely a great investment, okay? And let me just show you how it works once you download it. So let's say we want this hand holding mug, right? So we're just gonna go ahead and hit download. And I've actually already downloaded this, but I'm doing it again for you guys. <laughs> so we'll hit the um, open it, you'll extract it, extract it, go to it. So a lot of these work the same, okay? You'll need to go to the PDF file when you extract your file, go to the PDF and they're going to give you a link. And it'll open a new thing in Canva and you'll just edit from there. Okay, so it's a template that was created by someone and we're going to go ahead and use template for new design. Now you don't need Canva Pro to use the template, but if you want to save the template, you do need Canva Pro. Okay, so again, you might as well get Canva Pro free 30-day trial link in the bio all right and if you're enjoying this video you've learned something new please give your girl a thumbs up and make sure you're subscribed for more more awesome craft tutorials right and so you see right here it's kind of blank but then they give you um two backdrops right over here and we can just drag and drop those over to our uploads so we can use those as well so basically anything you're doing in Canva that has like these this little cloud and sky kind of background, you can drag and drop a photo into it. Okay. Bam.
Look at that. It looks very nice. And the same thing for the tumbler. Let's find so many images. Let's find a tumbler image. Okay, so this is actually a tumbler wrap, and I might have actually got that off Creative Fabrica. So look at that. That is so cute. Okay, and we can do the same thing for this one. Somebody love cats, you want a cat tumbler? There you go. And then you can add whatever background it is that you want um into it right and if you want to change the background you can just click it make sure it's selected hit right click and hit detach image and then we can just get that out of there okay and let's see why don't we just use the background that they gave us cute right awesome and here's another one another that other tumblr hook i've already uploaded it so this tumblr is this one okay so this tumblr design oh, there we go is that one so yes this one looks a little different but it works the same uh we're just going to upload that uh take your image i'll take this one and we need to move it to the back it needs to be the bottom layer okay so center back you see it needs to be behind it so it's still this one isn't necessarily a drag and drop but it still works it just needs to be behind it okay and they have a couple different tumbler they have this one let me delete They also have this one. Let me just sh shrink both those down so we can kind of fit multiple on one page. Right? And it's the same thing. You'll just go get your design and move it to the back. So you can right click it, hit layer, and send to the back. And then just position it however you want. Bring it down. Bam, Tumblr mock-up. Let's do another one. Okay, so here's another design. And I know I'm doing like these. These are pre-made designs that I got off Creative Fabric or whatever. But even if you're doing a custom Tumblr, you just make your design. Save it as a PNG. And then you'll be able this. So hold on. So save it as a PNG and then you'll be able to upload it. So this three tumbler thing is a great way to show off like a full wrapped tumbler. Like if you're doing a tumbler like this that is different on all the sides. It's a great way for them to see like all sides of the tumbler. And we all know mock-ups are super important for any business. So if you're not great at taking product pictures or... But who really just wants to make something, take a product picture if it's not already being sold? You get what I'm saying? So if you're just building it up, mockups are a great way to go. And like I said, there's a bunch on smartmockups.com. Um, there's a bunch already within Canva. And there's a bunch on creativefabrica.com. All of these will be listed for you in the link in the description box. I actually, I've done the Tumblr mockup, the shirt mockup, and a chip bag mockup video before okay and those will pop up and be linked for you as well now this one is a little bit different so let's go ahead and download that and i'll show you so we're going to go ahead and download and then we're going to extract it now this one has a text document where you can click it and you can copy right here and you can get the link and paste that into your browser or you can just take these two right here and upload them into hold on let's get over there and upload them into your Canva design. Just drag and drop. And she pretty much works the same as the Tumblr. It's whatever image you want. Oh, not that one. Hold on. So it's the black one. I'm sorry. So whatever image you want, it needs to be um what Im whatever image you want on a shirt needs to be the bottom layer okay so it needs to be behind her let me just make this a little bit bigger okay so a couple different options for you guys
Just a few example guys of some mockups that you can do um utilizing Canva. Canva create a fabrica like there's just so many things you can do, okay? So of course, I'll have some recommended mockup videos for you. They've popped up during the video, but I'll have them list listed in the description box as well. And your Canva and Creative Fabrica um, trial links in the description box of this video as well. And don't forget to join my email list to be notified of more awesome Canva tutorials like this as well. All right. So as always, thanks for watching. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. And until next time, guys, I'll see you later.